Hey guys, it's your girl Genevieve Ume. You know, right? Yeah, that's right. You've seen me on Blood Sisters, Far From Home, so much more. And guess what? I want MTV Day Sparks. It's gonna be lit. <laughs> Hi guys, your girl is now Patrick Kiki Susie Susie Savagi. And aside from being a fine girl, I'm also an influencer, actress, and a podcaster. This is MTV Base Parks, and it's about to be crazy. It's about to go with it. Let's get it. Let's go. You look cute. Girl, I like your nails. Look, I saw your cheese in it. Guy, I'm tired of seeing I'm sorry. I love you, but I'm tired of seeing Okay, you. what have you been up to? I mean, MTV Sugar, we've been on set together. You guys, like, Jen is acting as if we haven't been on set together. No, 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 no I'm, trying to, I'm trying to be the presenter here, you know. Facts, do your thing, do Thank your thing. You. So but we've been shooting together. Yes, we have. Yes, we have. We have MTV Sugar season five. How are you, are you excited? Extremely excited. How how was it when you got to the audition? Like how was it when you got the role? Like I couldn't believe it. Like because you know we've been we've been in the streets hustling, right? Like <laughs> and it's sugar and it's sugar, you know. Um, what else have we been doing aside from MTV Sugar Season Five? I mean, there's influencing, there's podcasting. Because like I'm about to start my new season of Surviving Lagos, and I can't wait for that. Lagos. But about for me. How about you? I love Surviving Lagos. Can we talk about that show? Like, I love... You brought Mr. Easy on our life. I yeah. didn't try. I didn't, you didn't try. I didn't try. Hello, so when am I going to be on the podcast? See, don't worry. Calm, the episode calm. that you're coming for... Calm, like, calm. 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 calm, I love calm. it. That's what I like to hear. That's what I like to hear. Period. So apart from Far From Home, I like dealing with like fame from Far From Home. What else? What's next? What's, what's happening? Um, I mean, I just wrapped Breath of Life. Um, completely. So that's an Amazon Prime original. Uh -huh. um, Big move. Yeah, so that's Can I the, for, uh, us for real. Literally, all the gang gang out there Can looking for. They're going to be eating. They're going to be eating with this year. Feast. She said, "Come and have fun. Come and pick. Come and eat." Wait. Yeah, Rats also another film. Um, I've also been doing some media rounds for MTV Sugar. Um, did Tanasa Anukam's show um, on YouTube. Is the seat taken? I love that show. I, love I can't that wait for show. yours. Because like I feel like vibe, like the vibe would match. Yeah, she's incredible. I love her. I love her. She's actually one of my closest friends now. Um, yeah, literally love that girl. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm gonna up to. Have you ever been like at an event and what was like the most embarrassing moment for you at that event? Like, think about Stuello. Don't come and give us, oh, my dress split. No. Like, no, it has to be embarrassing. Like, I don't know if it's like, like events, mm -hmm. but like. Public space. Yeah. Anywhere yeah, public. Yeah, like, okay, so I was really pressed. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's what I have to say. I was really <laughs> pressed. And there was a bit of an accident. But you know what? I appreciate the person that, you know, that I, you know, that it happened with because she was really kind to me. And she was like, oh, no, it happens in real it's life. Fine. And sometimes you could eat something the day before and your stomach, your stomach. Oh, my God. Jen, when you said first, I really thought like pee, but now you've helped me paint oh, the picture oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. of the first. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It, it, it do happen. It do happen. And it really happened, yeah. I think mine was like period, obviously. Like, oh yeah. And it was like you know what all those like outfits that you can tell like the outline of like. Ooh, so you had a whole like Ooh, girl. an outline. Oh, oh girl, how did you how did you how did you get over <laughs> I that? I feel like, like I like, scared some people that do like you know all these boys that no, were like no. oh my god period like I feel oh, like please. I scared them. I was like oh please Hi. please you guys you educated them. That's what you did. You have said, this is why I like you, girl genius for real for real. Period. <laughs> Have you ever stalked like someone you love? Someone because of like love? Yeah, I, you have? I stalked my first boyfriend. Like I was like I in like love and I was 18. And like, I literally thought my world was ending because you know, like, you know, yeah, like you love me, it's please. Normal. Love me. What did you do? Did you, do you call him? Did you call him? See, do you know what's funny, right? I wouldn't say stalk, you know, mm. but like I have this thing and it's a very bad habit and I need to grow. It's like, I would know the number of people you are following. 
If you are going out and I see I have followed if one more person, one, if it's, or two if it's more people, I'm going to do it. I have this spam account, Jen. Like, it's that bad. Like, even like, no, Jen, like, in the past, like, I can remember I followed somebody yeah. that I thought, like, my was talking to her, and like she was private and i was like eh I'm you want to be private i have a spam account i just can't follow this spam account I'm and she screaming. accepted i was like good now i can't see the inside what's juice. going on i can see who you are i can see your real face so baby girl you've been in this industry for a minute since you were young right what are your biggest challenges that you faced as an actor well i feel like growing up on screen mm. Because, like, it's so different, like, when you grow up, like, without people watching and then you grow up with people watching. Because now, like, oh. I go out and people are like, eh, I'm just a small girl. And it's like, I'm 20. <laughs> I'm not small yeah. anymore. Like, I'm grown. Yeah. I'm not small. Yeah. So, yeah, I think that was, like, the biggest challenge for me. Like, having, like, people tell me, oh, like, but you're yeah, young. We saw you. Like, ah, let that be. Sir, no. Yeah, they're not they, each other they, anymore. They haven't seen you evolve and they exactly. can't see past you. you, you they don't want to see you. Like, I literally post Instagram pictures and you see people commenting. I'm going to tell your daddy for you. Wow. Wow. Be for real. Wow. Be so for real. Wow. But however, you know, obviously, like, upcoming actors and actresses finding hard to, like, find their part in our industry. Do you feel like we have adequate structures and support systems for them? Um... I, I think so. I think so. Over the past few years, um, I would definitely say that I'm a product of Ebony Life Creative Academy. As an alumni, I think that that school is something that has really helped young people, um, especially behind the scenes and in front of the scenes as an actor. So yeah, Ebony Life Creative Academy and loads of other, um, I guess, platforms Ooh. like that. Um, and, I, and I think we've been kind of blessed to, to exactly. meet good people. Would you say you have anyone like a mentor in the industry, like in the film industry? Um, so coming up, I did have a mentor, um, but she's like kind of my auntie now, Lala Akindoju. Like she was like, I don't know, really, really fundamental in like helping me get into rooms. Um, I was assisting her at one point. Um, so yeah, she's definitely somebody that like helped me get into the rooms and see what it's like to work behind the scenes. Um, and then moving forward, I've had like Siomo Sage, you know, who we, who we love and is our sugar mommy, the EP of MTV Sugar season five. Um, she's somebody that I greatly, greatly admire. And I think there are lots of other incredible women within the industry. Let's even think about Boabudu, you know, who is a force for the entertainment industry, for our, you know, film industry completely. So yeah, there are lots of, lots of women to look up to. Mm -hmm.